my name is Shibby Williams and I am your health, wellness and fitness accountability coach and I want to welcome you to day 19 of this challenge. Whoop, 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 get excited, get excited, excited. So I am tired today, I had a long day yesterday, but I'm getting on here because I have made a commitment to you to be committed to this challenge so that you can be committed to the challenge as well. So we are going to start this day off great. If you are new, thank you for joining. You can still join us. It doesn't matter what day you start. Head over to my um, YouTube channel, LVX Fitness. Subscribe to the channel so that way you know when I post the videos in case you miss a day or you need to play catch up. We're going to go ahead and get started. We have two challenges to do for this month. We are doing a foot lifting challenge or a booty challenge. We're also doing a bedtime challenge. Today, we have a rest day from one of the challenges, so this, this workout will not be as long as uh, we normally are doing it. So I just want to quickly say, for those of you who are new, um, what the expectations are, and they are that you give 100%, you take breaks if you need to, you can modify the exercises, and always, always, always give it your all and your best. So if you cannot do everything I'm doing, that is fine. Do what you can, but give me 100%. If you can only do five and then take a break and do more, do so. If you can only do five and that's all you got, but you gave 100%, then that's all I asked for. I'm going to step back and we're going to get started. We are only going to be doing the booty challenge today. We are not doing um, the bedtime challenge. We have a rest from that day. So let's go ahead and get started. We're going to start on our feet. We are doing um, squats. So you can grab a chair, and if you're going to use a chair, you can squat down. You're going to always stick your butt back like this and squat, and then stand and squeeze. If you're using the chair, you want to go as low as you can, um, touching your legs or butt, and then standing right back up. Lightly touch. Don't sit in the chair. No cheating. So we're going to get started. We have 50, 50, 50, 50 squats to do, you guys. Here we go. But we can do it. Feet are flat on the floor. When we stand, we squeeze our legs and butt tight. We breathe out, abs are tight. Here we go. Sit back, stand up, squeeze. That's one. Down, two. Eventually, we'll pick up the pace um, to get that heart rate up. Four. Sit back, squeeze tight. Five. Sit back, squeeze tight. Six. Sit back, squeeze tight. Seven. Down and eight. Down and nine, ten. We'll do this in multiples of ten. One, down, two, squeeze tight, down, three, sit back, four, go as low as you can, five. Even if you only go a little bit down in the squat, that's fine. Seven, you want to squeeze when you stand regardless of how low you go. Nine. That's 20. At five, we're going to pick it up. One, down, two, sit back, squeeze tight, three, down, four, down, five. Here we go. Let's go. Pick it up. Down, six, down, seven, squeeze tight, eight. If I'm going too fast, you can slow down. 30, down, one, down, two. Sit back, three, sit back, four, down, five. Take a break if you have to. Seven, down, eight, down, nine, down, 40. One, two, three, we got this. Four, squeeze tight, five, five more. Five, four, breathe, three, two, Last one. Woo, squeeze tight. Ooh, my quads. Oh my goodness. Also during the event yesterday, <laughs> I took a spin class for 30 minutes. Oh my legs. <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and get on the floor. We're gonna go ahead and do our um, 25 bridges, I do believe. So I'm gonna lay down. You can use the chair as well. With the chair, you're going to lay your back on the seat of the chair. And we're going to tilt our hips up to the ceiling. We're going to go up in the air. 
Squeezing our butt and breathing out. Abs are always tight. We got 25. We can do this. Let's go, you guys. Up. Squeeze. One. Lightly touch your butt on the floor if you're on the floor. Three. Up. Four. Touch. Five. Touch. Six. Touch. Seven. We got this. Eight. Nine. Ten. Great job. One. Two. Whoo, I can feel this. Three. Four. Five. We got ten more. Ten. Nine. Eight. Squeeze tight. Breathe out. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two more. Last one. Whoo wee. Great job, everyone. Now, we're gonna do our last exercise for the morning, and that is our donkey kicks. Now, with donkey kicks, I'll show you, you can definitely use the back of the chair or place your hands on the seat. You can also um, kick back. You don't wanna swing. You're using the muscles, so you're kicking back or pushing back. So I'm gonna stand against the wall. My butt's gonna be facing you, but you're gonna kick back like this. I'm gonna do it from the side. You're standing, you're gonna kick back, or you're gonna push like that with your knee. You do that on the chair, or you can use the wall, just like I just showed you. Here we go. Everyone is on my count. Abs are tight regardless of where you are starting. Using a chair wall, abs stay tight the entire time. You're breathing out when you're kicking back or kicking up. Here we go. Up. That's one. Now, if your knee is bent, do not swing it past the other knee. You want to control. That's three. Four. Pay attention to your back. Five. Make sure it's not arching too much. Six. Seven. We're going slow. Eight. Slow and steady. We're winning the race today. Nine. Ten. Keep going. One, great job everyone. Two, we got this. Three, four, whoop, whoop. Five, we got 10 more, let's hit it. 10, don't swing your leg. Nine, this is swinging. That's swinging. <laughs> Eight, seven, six, Five, you may also feel this in your lower back. Four, three, abs tight, breathe out when you kick up. Two, or kick back. One, switch legs. Here we go. Other leg, let's go up. One, you do an upper back. Two. Three, great job. Four, five, six, good job everyone. Seven, abs tight, breathe out when you go up. Eight, nine, ten, great job, here we go. One, two, are you feeling this? I'm feeling this. Three on this leg. I don't even know why. Four. Five. Ten more. We got it. Ten. Nine. Great job. Eight. Push through. Seven. Take a break if you have to. Six. We got this though. Five. Four more. Here we go. Three more, and two more. Last one, whoo wee. Great job, everyone. I'm so proud of you for sticking it out. We finished, can you believe it? We are finished with today's workout. Great job. So, make sure you visit my website, www.leadingbyexample.us for more great health, wellness, and fitness tips. 
Also on the website you will find my book, Who Needs a Gym Using Social Media for Weight Loss. You can buy it there for an autographed copy. You can buy it on Barnes & Noble, Books A Million, and Amazon Online as well. There's also an ebook. Now, I will see you guys tomorrow for day 20, and you know what that means? We are two-thirds of the way finished with this challenge. Also, I know what I'm doing for the month of April, so if you're going to be joining me, be on the lookout for the post next week. All right, everyone. Bye. Keep pushing on.